there's little doubt that the CIA under Kennedy did try to kill Fidel Castro, and that's at the heart of a second theory, that Castro ordered the president's murder. Kennedy was trying to get Castro, but Castro got him first. Michael Kurtz teaches history at Southeast Louisiana University. He's written a book fingering Castro. The CIA had indeed contracted with the mafia to use hitmen to kill him. Well, Castro is a wily man. He must have known, if he was behind this, what the consequences would be. Why would he take that risk? You're quite right. There was a great risk of retaliation by the U.S. of a full-scale military invasion of Cuba and overthrow of him. Castro, in my opinion, came down to the most basic of human motives, survival. In fact, this was President Lyndon Johnson's theory. Aides say he was talking about Castro in this 1969 interview with Walter Cronkite. I can't uh, honestly say that I've ever been completely relieved of the fact that uh, there might have been international connections. You mean you still feel that there might, might have been? Uh, well, I have not completely discounted. Well, that would seem to indicate that you uh, don't have full confidence in the Warren Commission no. report. No, I think the Warren Commission study and I think, first of all, is composed the ablest, most judicious, bipartisan men in this country. Second, I think they had only one objective, and that was the truth. The third, I think they were competent and did the best they could. But I don't think that they are me or anyone else is always absolutely sure of every uh, thing that might have motivated Oswald or, or others that uh, could have been involved. Uh, but uh, uh, he uh, was quite a mysterious fellow, and he did have uh, connections that uh, uh, bore uh, examination and uh, the extent of the influence of those connections on him I think uh, history will deal with uh, much more than we're able to now. How would it come out in history? I don't know. Why would Fidel Castro risk touching off a war against his island in order to make Lyndon Johnson president of the United States? That's bizarre. Uh,